show you today I'm cutting some brinjal this is a brinjal and to make brinjal chutney I'll show you how I make brinjal chutney first I clean my brinjal soak it in the salt water and then I will make brinjal chutney I'll show you all when I'm braising after cutting I let it soak on five minutes in the salt water and then I will braise my brinjal I'll make a brinjal chutney okay, guys this is my brinjal about half a kilo of brinjal I got but I washed it, I cut and I salt, put salt and I soaked it and for this brinjal I have three quarter cup oil a few garlic here nearly one tablespoon salt some dhania some methi seed one tablespoon I have some green chilies curry leaf and I have five tomatoes that which I'm going to grate and one small onion so when I'm braising I'll show you guys my oil got a cup of oil and this is my multi seed This is my multi seed is frying. Now I'll use, I've got about six small green chilies and the ripe chilies together. This is now a small onion and my curry leaf. This is my garlic. I never made it very fine. It's rough garlic. And I blend out, fry it together. Then I will add tomato. I'm making blend out chutney like. Now I let my blend out fry. My brinjal is fried properly, then I will add the tomato and this is my little tablespoon salt. Okay, when I'm adding the tomato now I will show you. I will let it fry slowly. Guys, now I'll show you the brinjal is getting fried. This is how it must get fried. Now I'll add my tomato, the five tomato what I showed you. This is a tomato. Call it brinjal chutney. And I will let it cook for another slowly, another 10 minutes. Now I'll add my dania. So guys, this is the brinjal chutney. So 
It's almost cooked now. I'll need the, another five minutes of tomato to get, then it'll be ready. Hey guys, I'm going to show you. This is my brinjal chutney. It's ready now. That's how you make it. Thank you so much. Enjoy and share it.